Hi guys, this is Leanne from WoW Gold Helper. I started a tune on a new server to show others that it is possible to get gold before level 20. Today's video is to show uh, me putting up auctions. I uh, left my character in Stormwind, that's where I am right now. I left him here last night um, because I uh, was questing and I left him here because I knew I'd be hopefully making a video today which I am now I gotta show you something very odd that happened I went AFK earlier and I came back to this uh, somebody threw a bunch of heavy leather balls in my uh, backpack now uh, this is actually a bad thing because this interferes with my experiment so I can't sell them on the AH because the point of making this tune is to show others that you can earn gold from uh, mining, skinning, whatever you may choose. So, what I'm going to do for the time being is actually head over to the Stormwind Bank here and uh, put these heavy leather balls in uh, in my bank to sell at another time. This is my first time using the bank on this tune. He is only level 9, so... Um, this server that I chose is for new players. It's a normal server. I've never played of it before. This is my first time hearing of it. And I've actually noticed this server has a lot of uh, server lag. Like, not drastic lag, but uh, more lag than I'm used to. So what we're going to do is put these here. I will sell. After my experiment is done, I will sell those then. Anyways, so... This tune's level 9. In case you don't know, you can learn your professions at level 5 now instead of level 10, so that helps out greatly if you're going to be a miner, skinner, or herbalist. I chose mining and skinning on this character for the reason that uh, I find choosing um, mining and herbing together is a bad idea because both require you to use your map to search for the uh, items to farm them. Uh, whereas with skinning, you just would be skinning animals, so having that plus mining or herb herbalist um, seems better, in my opinion. Um, you'll see, I have 17 silver, 24 copper. All of this is from questing and selling junk, which right now, if we look at my bag here, um, I have stuff I can't even sell yet, like my linen. I'm not selling that till it's a stack of 20. I don't have two stacks of copper yet, and I only have 13 pieces of light leather. The rest is scraps. However, during a, during a couple quests, I actually forgot to skin some of the animals, and I realized, oh crap, I'm a skinner. Why didn't I remember? <laughs> Anyways, what we're going to look at is copper. See how much it's selling for. So, we don't care about any of this up here. We want to see how much a thing of 20 is selling for, which the lowest price at current has a uh, buyout amount of 7 gold. So, I, you know, I undercut. When I sell stuff, I always undercut. Um, and to be safe, I always put my auctions in for 48 hours, which actually can be a waste of time as it costs more to do that. <clears throat> So, uh, we're going to put this as a starting price of 5 gold, and the buyout is going to be 6 gold, 50 silver. Create auction. So just like that, my character is only level 9, and probably later today, he will have 6 gold at level 9. Now, I know you may be thinking that's really not that amazing, and honestly, it, it isn't. I mean, it really, it's not, because the higher level you are, the more gold you will make. However... Uh, for a starting out character who needs gold by level 20 to buy your first uh, ground mount, um, in that regard it's important, and it's, you know, important to have the gold to buy that. Uh, this character is by himself on the server, so I have no way, uh, like, not gonna be send, can't send him gold or anything like that. Whatever he earns is basically how it's gonna be. Now, I wanna just look at prices of linen and leather. Uh, while we're here, though, I can't, like, I'm not selling them, but I still want to see. So, three gold for a stack of 20 of linen. That's not really that bad. I mean, it is quite low level. Wool usually sells a lot better anyways than linen, but, uh, as you're questing, you're, like, you will collect linen, um, the same as if you decide to be a leather worker, you'll be able to get leather very easily, because a lot of quests require you to kill animals. So, we're going to look at leather now. <clears throat> uh, 
All right, so uh, 18 gold uh, buyout price for light leather. That's not really that bad either because you're going to have a lot of quests with killing animals. And if you really want it to, to finish making your stack, you could easily uh, go to L1, go to Westfall, wherever, and just bang, 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 kill some animals, get out of there, your stack is complete. Now I also have a stack of rough stone, so we're going to see how much rough stone may be selling for, which rough stone, from my experience on uh, my home server, never sells for a lot. Like I think the most I've seen it was maybe 80 silver buyout, so this server, 8 silver, 20 copper is the buyout. That's okay, I'm willing to sell it for a very cheap amount. So what we're going to do is put a uh, buy uh, starting price of 5 silver buyout price will be 7 silver and honestly there's no reason why uh, you know somebody won't buy that like these really should both sell later on today <clears throat> now I had mentioned uh, in my blog um, if you did read my blog and my post not to repair your arm armor because you're always replacing it now obviously at high level don't you know don't follow that like if you're a very high level character but if you're starting out the amount of time that you're going to be constantly replacing armor because of quest and whatnot it's really not worth fixing at all um, and I mean, it's it's money gone from your pocket that you really don't need to be spending while you're trying to earn your first few gold. So I just want to throw that out there again. Um, Alright, so this character, as I said, he's level 9. He has 15 silver, 4 copper. What I'm going to do is probably later on uh, log in and check the auctions. Um and probably level him some more and uh, you know one thing I want to throw out there too when I'm questing on this character I don't go farming for copper or anything if it's beside me where I'm questing I run over to it I mine it I don't run all over the map looking for it the reason for this is because Elwyn Forest is an excellent spot for farming copper and you're pretty much all over the map anyways while questing so it, it's quite easy to get a stack, two stacks, maybe even three, depending how long you're there, and if you do decide to do a bit of farming. Uh, however, I'm going to sign off on this video now. I probably won't be making a second video showing that my auction sold. It probably will just be a blog post with pictures. I just want to throw the video up there, though, because I want people to see like proof that this is, in fact, a low-level 2 and level 9, and that he only has, uh, like I said, 15 silver uh, for copper. Anyhow, I uh, hope you enjoyed my video, and have a nice day.